投资机会是什么。Well, I know it's a good company. At least it has been in the past.、Uh, everybody's excited because the people who get the shares, well, I would not buy it <coughs> when it pops up, because that's usually not a good thing to do historically.、Mm-hmm. Uh, you're going to buy it sooner or later. I have no idea what I'm going to do. About people's concerns about Alibaba's structure of the stock's ownership,、uh, you think that's a legitimate concern? Well, I know it's better if if you structured the way normal companies do, so that the shareholders do, can vote and do have con- ultimate control. So yes, this is not good、uh, compared to other companies. Now, the people running Alibaba have been and are smart people, so we presume in the end they'll do what's best for themselves and. For Alibaba, because they're the same. Alibaba's major markets are all focused in China. They're the biggest、uh, e-commerce company. Alibaba's management they know China a lot better than the Western stockholders, institutional investors. Maybe that's a good thing for them to be in control because they don't have to do things to please the investors, but mess up the market itself. Well, as I said, yes. In the past, they have been smart people who've done the good things for Alibaba and for themselves. I presume that in the future. They will do the same way. I'm just saying, though, that if there's if there's some kind of situation, there is no safety valve, which there would be for other more regularly governed companies. What are you investing right now? Give us. In Russia, I was negative on for 46 years. I'm investing in Russia now. I was very bearish for a long time, but Russia is a disaster. It's hated by the stock market. It's hated by everybody. I think only Argentina is more hated, probably.、Mm-hmm. China, I'm investing in in a little way. Uh, have been since November. Japan, I'm investing in. There, there are always opportunities if one looks around. Some people were saying Chinese economic growth because of anti-corruption、uh, slowed down the consumption market. But none of this is bad for China. Slow down and cl- cl- sorting out the system to prevent overheating is good for any economy. Economies that go straight up all the time end up in a problem. So I don't see a problem. I don't have a,、uh, an issue with what's happening in China. It's good for China. Would you invest in any sectors of、uh, China? Yes, I, I, since November. In November, they had the、uh, economic forum in in Beijing, and they and the government said these are the sectors we're going to be emphasizing for the next、uh, 10 or 20 years. So. I mean, if Beijing is going to spend billions of dollars on some parts of the Chinese economy, I am too. You know, they have more money than I do. They're smarter than I am. So of course, I'm going to be、uh, in, uh, investing in those sectors. I have started looking. I have started investing in a small way, not much, because there are some problems in the debt market and the property market. But no, I haven't. Been investing and will continue to invest. I want to come back to the Russian market a little bit. Between Ukraine and Russia, there's a possible conflict, and then the mar- in Russian、uh, that the market was coming down lately. And you think that's a ch- good chance to get in? How come you were so bullish? Well, you're supposed to buy low、uh, when things are collapsing. I bought back in March、uh, and April when things were really collapsing. I've noticed that the Russian market is not. Continued to make new lows. It's been going up since, since March and April, to my surprise and delight, I should point out.、Uh, so I am looking for more investments. In, you're supposed to buy low.、Mm. And Russia has very cheap,、uh, huge resources. In Russia, it's not a debtor nation. It's got big、uh, assets. So, in my view, there are opportunities in Russia. 以上就是这节的环球财经，谢谢您的收看。现在将现场将会在香港直播室主播任任。